Excellency Mr. Tillerson for his statement. I shall now make concluding remarks in my capacity as the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Japan. Japan has consistently devoted itself to create a free and democratic country, respecting human rights and abiding by the rule of law, and to support peace and prosperity in the Asia-Pacific region as a peace-loving nation. The path Japan has walked as a peace-loving nation will not change in future and contribute to the peace and prosperity of the world more than ever before. In our meeting today, we have condemned in the strongest terms the acts of provocation by North Korea in violation of relevant Security Council resolutions. We once again made it clear that the international community will never accept a nuclear armed North Korea. I call on all the member states to fully implement the relevant Security Council resolutions and maximize international pressure on North Korea in order to realize a denuclearized Korean Peninsula. After our presidency this month, Japan will leave the Security Council. However, we will continue to cooperate closely with the remaining and incoming members, as well as non-Security Council members, so that the North Korean issue will be properly addressed in the Council. I resume my function as a